Hey guys! So, is it just me, or have you guys been loving the life hacks video? Well, you're in luck, because that is exactly what I'm going to do today. I hope you learned something different from what I have to say from these life hacks. And I've learned these life hacks from other people, so I will be giving them credit in the video. So let's get started because I'm really excited and it should be fun. So the life hacks aren't going to be in order, but the first thing I see here on my bed is the first thing I grabbed. So did you know you can use aloe vera gel to reduce the size of your acne and pimples. Well, that is my favorite life hack to use for acne, if you guys don't know that already. So I really recommend this tip, especially for you girls that really hate applying acne cream. I'm a person that doesn't get an overload of acne. It's only um, a certain acne and that's ha that happens with hormonal acne. So you can pick this up at Target or any drugstore drug near you. I recommend getting an all natural, all natural one. Use the detangle brush. I use currently um, my mom just grabbed the L'Oreal L'Oreal Kids Paraben Free um, Detangler Spray and any detangler spray will work fine. If you've never seen these brushes or these type or um, you've always wanted one, 100% Amazon is worth it. These brushes are what I will always use from now on. And if you want to check out my thoughts on this brush, I actually have a review on my channel that I will be sure to have a link for you guys. So I hope you check it out because I really recommend it. And all these hacks are my favorite. So I just wanted to remind you guys and also, if you haven't tried them, it's also awesome because the easier beauty things are, the more fun beauty is. And on to another shower life hack related to hair and detangling and fast drying is I know I've got all these different tips from different people, so you guys will know in the video. And using a t-shirt on your hair when your hair is still a bit damp, but after your shower, is actually super soft and super absorbent. So if you have a spare t-shirt that you don't wear, but you still want to keep, then I recommend just scrubbing your hair, kind of like you're scrubbing your hair to wash it, but dry it, and use a t-shirt. I got this tip from Nicole, Nicole Guerrero here on YouTube. I got the aloe vera tip from RCL Beauty, Rachel Levin. So thank you guys for the tips. And this next few tips I got from Style Collective is applying mascara. So I have the Rocket Volume Mascara by Maybelline. If you guys, you guys have seen this before, you know that it's a fairly good mascara and my, my mom pur purchased it for me again this Christmas and I like it. I have no problems with it. 
So this is the current one I'm using right now. And just your favorite black eyeliner. So what you want to do is you want to apply a mascara before, as much mascara as you want before your eyeliner. And Katie from Sky Style Collective said exactly how I feel. It's kind of like you have a guideline on where exactly you want your eyeliner. And applying eyeliner is faster if you apply mascara first. So apply mascara, do what you do, and then kind of figure out where you want your line to be and then you have more control on where you want your line to be and you can get used to doing better. It, in my opinion, it turns out better in the end. My last hygiene tip for you guys. I hope you guys know this one because this one is awesome and it cuts down the amount of effort you need to take in the shower immensely and it's just great. So when you're washing your hair and all that, focus your shampoo on your roots. So shampoo on your roots and the back of your head. For me, I use more shampoo than conditioner because I'm an oily haired girl. So um, I feel you guys when you say, oh my gosh, my hair is so oily. Um, that is probably my number one tip for you guys. And that will help you guys. So it will also make your hair washing a little bit more uh, relaxing and not like as much of a, as much of a hassle when you know you don't have to use as much shampoo. My last tip for you guys: Do you dislike? doing your nails, doing manicures because of the dry time. I have an even, even better extra little pointer for you guys. Okay, so dry time. When your nails are just about dry, basically dry, so then when you can move, go over to your sink and put your fingernails under cold wa water but more than once so put your fingernails there for like maybe a minute maybe like um at least 30 seconds and then put your fingers in there again anyway i love life hacks what about you did you enjoy this? I hope so. Thank you guys, and I really hope you have a reminder in your in your head to go try these out because I really enjoy them. But my two favorites that I really recommend for you guys is the t-shirt for your hair. Once you get out of the chair, out of the shower and the mascara before eyeliner aloe vera gel tip is definitely a great one so those are my top three I will make sure to leave all the information that I included in this video and all the information below as well so look out for that I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for watching. Alright guys, I will see you very soon. Stay positive. Have a great day because you're wonderful. Thanks guys. Bye.